Hello guys, Dennis LG here, uh, drinking my second can of Young's Double Chocolate Stouts. I'm going to do a brief review for you, even though I already reviewed this beer almost two years ago, if not two years ago. So this is the Nitra Widget Can version you mostly can find in the US. Uh, it's not sold here. We just get the bottle version and that was pretty recent that we started to get that in Montreal. And uh, in Europe I haven't seen it. I saw it, I saw it in the supermarket in Moscow actually but it was about four dollars and it was the same can you get in the US so I guess it was imported from the US after it being imported from the UK it's the same ABV you get in the bottle 5.2 and it's brewed by the Wilson Youngs brewery I believe in Bedford if I'm not mistaken yeah Bedford which is pretty much London UK and uh, very nice looking can the violet top and orange bottom very stylish in my opinion much better than the, the actual bottle. Uh, it's 440 milliliters or 14.9 US fluid ounces which is the same serving you get in Guinness cans and Boddington's and all of those except for John Smith's. Uh, but actually I think I believe that the, the can is the same they use for most European beers. Half liter can just that the widget takes more space. Anyhow I really took a few sips and uh, this is how it looks. Dark brown body almost looks like a Guinness almost blackish but the head is actually a it's of a light camel color you get to so the head very creamy typical of the nitrogen um, nitrogenation I suppose so the aroma very chocolatey not as intense I believe as the bottle version I haven't had that in a while but um, very creamy and it's more milk chocolate like than you know bitter chocolate and it's definitely uh, very reminiscent of a milkshake, something chocolate flavored. So the taste. Mm. This is this is what I expected originally from the bottle, because I think the first reviews I'd seen before trying the beer, before I finally got to it, um, were all of this version, and people describe this as you know creamy, milky, smooth and very chocolatey while the actual bottle version is a bit more intense in flavor but you definitely don't get this nice texture and I prefer this actually quite sweet very chocolatey roasted malt kind of dark a bit of coffee um, this is something I didn't get originally in the bottle version and uh, that was not sweet enough for me this is sorry this is exactly what I expected and this is exactly what it is Mm. I'm serving this fairly cold, but it's very, very tasty. Yeah, guys, Young's Double Chocolate Stout. If you're in the US and you still haven't tried this, go pick up a four pack or just a single. Uh, in Albany, it was, I think, about $10 for a four pack, quite reasonable. I paid about three for a single, so that's quite good. Much better than Guinness. It's uh, it got, It's got a fuller body to it, more sweetness, a bit more flavor. So if you if you just had Guinness or Boddington's, this is probably the next next step to go to take, I suppose. If you like chocolate, if not, well, you can still try it. It's a good kind of sweet stout. All right, so this was it. Nice, nice beer. Finally, happy to say I've tried both versions. Um, still yet to find it on tap though. All right, six good beer. See you next time. Bye.